In a world where dangerous is an understatement, come with us as we look at the world's most shockingly risky jobs. Number 1. The Pufferfish Taste Tester of Tokyo There is a job called Pufferfish Taste Tester in Tokyo, where sushi is both food and an art form. This job is a mix of cooking skills and wild sports. These food gladiators don't just like seafood, they also like adrenaline, and every time they take a bite, they're playing with death. The star of this high-stakes dining drama is the pufferfish, locally known as fugu. This fish is the diva of the sea, stunningly delicious but deadly dramatic. It's like dining with a beautiful but temperamental celebrity who might decide to poison you if you say the wrong thing. The lethal parts of fugu contain tetrodotoxin, a toxin so potent that a dose smaller than a pinhead can send you to that big sushi bar in the sky. Our taste-testing heroes face this aquatic assassin, armed with nothing but their taste buds and a sense of culinary adventure. Each slice they sample is a dance with danger, a nibble of near death. They say every fugu meal is a brush with mortality, a reminder of life's fragility served on a plate. One wrong cut, a slight slip of the knife, and BAM! You're suddenly having an out-of-body experience floating above the dining table, watching your physical form contemplate its last sashimi. This is no ordinary job, it's a gastronomic game of pew, Russian roulette, pew, pew. where every mouthful could be your last and every dinner shift could end with an impromptu meeting with your ancestors, discussing family recipes in the afterlife. The Pufferfish Taste Tester, where the only thing sharper than the knife is the taste of danger. Bon appetit or perhaps sayonara. Number 2. The Volcano Selfie Photographer of Hawaii In a world where Thrill Seeker is a job title, we look to the sunny but hot slopes of Hawaii, where volcano selfie photography is becoming a very popular risky job. In this case, a good day at work doesn't mean meeting goals. It means staying away from a stream of molten lava. These thrill seekers climb active volcanoes without science gear, just selfie sticks, and don't care about the phrase, too hot to handle. As they ascend these fiery mountains, their job is simple yet hair-raising. Capture that perfect selfie with a backdrop of lava that's hotter than the latest trend on social media. The ideal shot? You, grinning, with a river of lava photobombing in the background. But here's the catch. One wrong step, a slip of the foot, or a sudden eruption, and you're no longer the photographer. You become a modern-day Pompeii statue. These photographers flirt with danger like it's their high school sweetheart. They play a risky game of hot potato with Mother Nature where the potato is a 2 0, 0, 0 degree Celsius molten rock. And if that lava decides to get up close and personal, let's just say, you might end up with the world's hottest makeover. In this profession, having a burning desire for risk isn't just a metaphor, it's a daily reality. So next time you see a volcano selfie, remember, it's not just a photo, it's a survival trophy. Number 3. The Australian Outback Animal Wrangler in a land where everything that crawls, hops, or slithers is seemingly out to get you, the Australian Outback Animal Wrangler reigns as the champion of dangerous day jobs. This isn't just a career, it's an ongoing battle against Mother Nature's most cranky creations. Imagine starting your day with a wrestling match against a crocodile who missed his morning coffee. That's just the warm-up. Then there are the venomous snakes, so deadly they can kill a man in under an hour. But for these wranglers, it's just another Tuesday, charming these slithery assassins like they're auditioning for Serpents Got Talent. One wrong move, and it's lights out in the most dramatic fashion. Let's not forget the kangaroos, nature's bouncy boxers, who seem to have skipped anger management classes. Getting kicked by one of these adorable marsupials is like being hit by a furry freight train. They don't just knock the wind out of you, they send you flying into next week. And then there are the spiders. Oh, the spiders. Some are so gargantuan they've been rumored to carry away small pets. A casual encounter with these eight-legged freaks can turn a grown man into a shrieking child. In summary, the life of an Australian outback animal wrangler is a constant dance with danger. It's like being in an action movie, except the stunts are real. And the actors? Well, they're not acting! Number 4. The Arctic Ice Road Trucker it's always cold and snowy where the Arctic ice road trucker lives. Welcome to the dangerous, frostbitten world of the trucker. Think about this. The roads are so slippery that polar bears are asking for salt. What you see here aren't just any roads. 
Their icy paths that hang dangerously over frozen lakes, and look at the sun with the same coldness as a vampire looks at garlic. The Arctic Ice Road Trucker is the king or queen of this glacial maze, driving rigs that are heavier than a group of elephants wearing lead boots. Think driving in snow is a challenge? These truckers see your snow and raise you a blizzard, with side orders of black ice and visibility so poor, it makes a game of blind man's bluff look like a clear day in the Sahara. One wrong turn, and it's not just a matter of calling roadside assistance. Oh no, you're more likely to be calling for a search and rescue team. If your radio isn't already frozen solid, this isn't a job. It's a thrill-seeking, adrenaline-pumping extreme sport where the truckers dance with danger and flirt with frostbite. And the reward for this daring dance on the slippery slopes of the Arctic? A cozy paycheck and the kind of job satisfaction only found when your daily commute could double as an episode of an extreme survival show. So, hats off or rather, firmly on and thermal, to these intrepid warriors of the winter roads. Number five, the Amazonian Jungle Guide. In the depths of the Amazon, where even GPS signals fear to tread, our brave jungle guides embark on a daily game of Survivor, the Extreme Edition. These intrepid souls navigate a labyrinth of greenery so dense, it makes your overgrown backyard look like a putting green. Here, every leaf could be a novella in 101 Ways to Die in the Jungle. First up, we have the plants. Oh, these aren't your grandma's potted ferns. No, sir, these plants are so poisonous. Just brushing against them might have you hallucinating conversations with a sloth. And that's a best case scenario. Worst case, let's just say you might become an impromptu participant in the circle of life. Then there are the jaguars. They aren't just curious. They're like nosy neighbors with fangs and a taste for adventure. One wrong step and you could end up starring in a jaguars version of a snack unboxing video. And the mosquitoes. These aren't your average bloodsuckers. They're like flying hypodermic needles with a PhD in human anatomy. They buzz around, plotting their strategy like tiny winged vampires, turning you into an all-you-can-eat buffet. Surviving as a jungle guide isn't just a job. It's an art form, a dance with nature, where the rhythm is unpredictable and the dance floor is booby-trapped. But hey, on the bright side, if you make it out alive, you've got stories that'll trump anyone's at a dinner party. Number six. The Siberian Tiger Dentist. In Russia's huge, cold wilderness, where even the bears wear coats, there is a job that changes what it means to have an occupational hazard. Come into the world of the Siberian Tiger Dentist. This is a very dangerous job that makes diffusing bombs look like a game of bingo. Imagine that you are in the middle of Siberia, covered in snow, with only a toothbrush and the bravery to laugh at danger. Your client? A 500-pound Siberian tiger with a toothache and a temperament to match. Now, convincing a creature that can sprint at 50 miles per hour and whose idea of a snack is something that once had a pulse, that it's time for its dental hygiene routine, is no small feat. As a Siberian tiger dentist, you get up close and personal with jaws that could easily turn you into human confetti. You're not just checking for cavities. You're performing a balancing act on the tight rope of life. While you're peering into the gaping maw of your furry patient, thoughts of being an accidental hors d'oeuvre are never far from your mind. Every plaque scrape could be your last, and every flossing session is a brush with mortality. But fear not, for these dentists are not just professionals in oral hygiene. They are unspoken heroes in a land where even the snowflakes probably have muscles. In short, the Siberian tiger dentist doesn't just clean teeth. They dance with danger, grapple with the improbable, and if all goes well, live to tell the tale, I mean, tale. As this video of the deadliest jobs in the world ends, think about this twist. Maybe the biggest adventure begins when you switch from watching to doing. Who knows, the next daring job we feature could be yours.